Hey, it's Ian Sean here, and we are just quickly going to give you a few little tips and tricks to hopefully help you get uh, either improve the quality of your sleep, get a better night's sleep. As we know, if you get a good sleep, you're going to be feeling fresh, invigorated, you're about to train hard, you'll get better results in the gym. So a lot of people we speak to, a lot of members, a lot of people we speak to outside the gym, struggle to get a decent number of hours of sleep per night. I mean, what would you say minimum number of hours of sleep per night you want to be getting to, to sort of really get Ideally, you're looking between six to eight hours, and that sounds that does sound quite obvious and easy, and everyone knows it. But I've always got something in mind that if you sleep before twelve, two uh, one hour is worth two. Have you ever thought of that? Mm, I haven't actually. Yeah. No. So if you I go to bed that. at ten, you actually get four hours. Okay, okay. So if you're getting maybe six hours, twelve till six, maybe try more of a, a ten till four, ten till five approach, and see if, see if you feel any better there. But okay. definitely before midnight, I think one hour is worth two. Yeah, I like that. Well, that's, that's people thought because it's not something I thought about before. But I mean, certainly for me, I think the minimum. I mean, always I'm always looking at minimum six. I mean, seven if I can. Um, my little tip would be again, and this is a bit of a no-brainer, but it, and people will say, well, I can't do it, but just trying to get to bed earlier. You're know, just trying to trying to bring your bedtime back from midnight to ten or even before then, and then just and then just if you're worried about losing hours of the day, maybe maybe it's it's, it's it's work time or family time or whatever it might be, try and add that on to the beginning of your day. So for me, you know, I try and get, go to bed half nine, ten latest, but I'm up at you know kind of. Would you say that's linked half to four or five? Sleep with the seasons. So in the winter, try and sleep more, go to bed earlier, stay in bed a bit later. But in yeah, the summer, yeah, absolutely. Stay up a bit later, wake up a bit early because. So absolutely yeah absolutely yeah so you know just try and try and take advantage of the of the, of the way the seasons work absolutely I, I think you'll find in winter just getting wrapped up nice and early get the curtains drawn get the heat on you know kind of get your window open and just get some you know get some fresh air but you know it's it's, it's you always feel better and it's tough in winter obviously as well so it's summer you get the sun the vitamin d in as well and also you always feel a lot more everyone just feels more en- yeah, energized definitely. so so some simple tips okay phones out the window yeah no phones. I'm phones ha- off. How many hours before bed? A good couple of hours. Yeah, 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 yeah. Try to, you know, no, no Facebook, no texting, yeah, you can, no calls. Good. You know, no. Sign off from work. Spend some family time. Yeah, absolutely. You try and switch off. Yeah. Absolutely. Watch um, it. maybe a little bit of TV to unwind. Yeah, it could do. Half hour, an hour. Yeah, half an hour, maybe, maybe to an hour. And again, I wouldn't. I would try and get that in a little bit earlier if you can. Try not to watch TV yeah. straight before you go to bed because it just it just keep, the brain just stays active. Yeah. Um, and I find sometimes you, 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 I'm sure some of you guys out there will, will be familiar with this. You you feel awake till twelve o'clock, one o'clock because yeah, you're constantly thinking. You just constantly but your brain's turned on. So yeah, phones, TVs off. We need a dark room. Yeah, absolutely. So blackout blind. Get yourself a blackout mask, blind. Eye mask you can wear. Or, yeah. or an eye mask. Yeah. Yeah. However you want to do it, you've got to try and get total darkness because yeah. you will get a much much better better quality sleep. Yeah. Absolutely. Would you have a TV in the bedroom? Now, it's, it's, it's a bad one, because I have a TV in the bedroom, but, so I, but I haven't watched it. Yeah. I haven't watched it yet. So, ideally, I would say that, I mean, that is probably a, probably a no-no. If you can help it, try and remove the TV out of the bedroom, or, or certainly, if you watch it during the day, that's fine, but not... not so, not. read a book. Yeah. Spend more time just Relax. kind of chatting, spending time with kids. Yeah. You know, you know, by the end of the day, if you've done everything right, if you've done your work, if, you, if you've done your training... You should be feeling ready to sleep. You don't want to go to bed, don't you? Exactly right. So, that comes down to having, like, having a good routine getting up early, doing your work and your work hours, doing your family time and your family hours, and then just going to bed. And it's just that, you know, developing that routine, I always find. Yeah, no, no, no absolutely. There's one, one that we've not really talked about as, as, as coffee drinkers, as caffeine yeah. addicts as well. You know, um, if you have too much of that caffeine going into your system, it's going gonna, it's, it's gonna to affect your sleep. It's a very, very simple equation. So I would stop, try to stop having hot drinks like that after no later than 2 o'clock. Yeah, I agree. No later than 2. Definitely. Um, you know, limit your coffee to 2 to 3 good cups a day, small cups. And I think you'll, I think I'll definitely have a. What about a power nap? Power nap. Um, Do you have any of these days? I, I don't normally, but if you feel like you need one, I think yeah. I, I would keep them on the short side. Yeah. 15, 20, 20 minutes. minutes. Yeah. Yeah. 15, 20 minutes yeah. max, really. Any longer than that, I think it, 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 it tends to feel a bit groggy. You so. feel like you want to go into a bit of a deeper sleep, don't you? Yeah. Or you're not allowed to. And then it kind of, it kind of affects your sleep later on. So. Yeah. So power nap's okay. Power nap's okay. So, so just to recap, we have no TVs, phones. Yeah. We have. Um, Dark room. Dark room, eye masks, yep. bedtime routine, sleep with the seasons. Yeah. So more in the winter, less in the summer. Um, uh, power nap. One? And power naps, yeah. Power naps and are good. Limit your caffeine. Yeah. There you so have it, guys. Okay, give that a try. Hope you sleep like a baby. See you in short. Say, take care, comb your hair. See you soon. Bye bye.